we have the same therapist. I introduced him. I introduced him to my therapist. If I'm in therapy one day and I come out and look who's sitting in the lobby, hey bro. <laughs> and and at this first session, he called me. He was like, man, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you bro. Actually, all of our therapists. Yes. Yes. He's all of us. No, 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 you don't go yeah, as much as we need. I don't go as much as I should. We need a little bit more. We look crazy. No, 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 no. You know what? 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 I'm like, they not here. I apologize, though. Y'all know we've been friends. Excuse me, bro. We've been friends for almost 40 years. Oh, my. Yeah. So before all of this, we was just a nobody. <laughs> but you know what I do want to uh, address? I do want to apologize for what I just did, because I don't know if anybody caught the stigma, the culture stigma that I just did. I said we both crazy, and that's the stigma, that's the problem, I wanna own that. If you notice, crazy ain't got nothing to do with therapy. Right. But I own that because that's how much in our black culture, we identify therapy with what something gotta be wrong with you. And so I definitely wanna take that back, my apologies, because I'm having to also- And we, we, and we such close friends, but I just, it just blew right by me, because I may say something about that. But it also blew by you also because it's so much part of our culture. Right. We're so engrafted in the culture, thinking it, we're not even consciously aware. Right. So, there's nothing wrong with you. Nothing. Get one, I have. Go, if you can go, go. Find me somebody. And I am. 